before we get into anything, let's just calm down. Chris Drury, his first couple weeks, and his moves, a lot has been questioned, of course. However, this Pavel Buchnevich move, we have to talk about it. Was it the right move? Was there actually room to fit him in the lineup and in the salary cap? Let's talk about it. Buchnevich was traded to the St. Louis Blues the other day for Sammy Blay and a second round pick for next year's draft. Sammy Blay is not Pavel Buchnevich. The return that Chris Drury got for Pavel Buchnevich is very underwhelming. However, it's not like Sammy Blay can't fit into this lineup. This will also give the opportunity for Capo Caco, Vitaly Kravtsov, Alexei Lafreniere to play themselves into the top six. Chris Drury and the head brass clearly don't see Buchnevich fitting under the salary cap for long term. And Buchnevich deserves to get paid long term and a lot of money. He is becoming the player that the Rangers drafted him to be over the last couple of seasons. And I know that hurts to see him go. Buch is a fan favorite. We drafted him eight years ago. A third round pick who's been surprising us a lot. It really does suck to see him go. But in my mind and in Chris Drury's mind, he just doesn't fit this team long term. And I knew this was going to be a problem when they extended him two seasons ago after his first contract expired. It just doesn't make sense to keep him on this roster. I love him. I would love for him to be on this roster. But long term, you have way too many young kids buying for a top six spot who are currently cheaper right now who may become better than Buchanovich in the future. And Sammy Blay is a player who can play in the bottom six. He won a Stanley Cup for the St. Louis Blues. He was a big part of that team back in 2019. I like Blay. I liked him a few seasons ago. I always thought there was more upside offensive potential towards him. He hasn't hit that right away. But as the Rangers roster is shaping up right now, he can easily fit in that bottom six and easily be effective. Believe it or not, Sammy Blay's best offensive season was last year. 15 points, 8 goals, 7 assists in 36 games. He should fit in Galan's system well. We'll see where he ends up. Booch, thank you so much for your time as a New York Ranger. It was an honor to meet you when I did back in the 16-17 season at the Barclays Center. I appreciate everything you've done for this team, and I'll see you in St. Louis. <laughs>